Hello guys, I'm back here with an update of the case of my of my build. All right, you guys know the intake build. Here's the reservoir. I mounted it up here in the case. I drilled screws back here so I can get this mounted on. It was kind of difficult to put it on, but I managed. Then I have the pump down here. I'm gonna have the intake. Into here, I'm gonna have the pipe going down around here and into there. Once I had it so it went like this, but since I have the fan for the side, it's gonna be against the tubing. So I took that pipe the tubing off and I'm gonna now make it longer so it's gonna be from like that because if it's shorter, it blocks the fan. And I had it connect, I had the reservoir connected too, but. It was, I don't know why I disconnected it. I'm going to figure something out for that. I want to make the tubing better. Then I'm going to have, I think for the CPU or right here, and it's going to go over right here. And I got my hand stuck in the fan. Alright. Then you guys can see, right here, this is the UV light. It's, it's behind the bracket, like in the middle of the bracket of the water the reservoir so this was kind of hard to do because the screws that were that you connect into this to hold this bar to hold the reservoir I had to cut those so this can fit in and I had to like put it you know under it as you, as you can see right there yeah that's gonna be kind of cool when they have the UV liquid inside of here speaking about UV liquid Here's the look that I don't know if you can tell, but yeah. The Fessel one. Yeah. Ordered, ordered it and came in yesterday. And I have some other stuff that came in yesterday now. You guys will see that pretty soon. And here we go. You guys can see the light. Nothing special really. Not that much big change, just this. And I ordered my motherboard today, and I'm going to show you what I just ordered. You guys know which board this is. The EVGA X58. Should be coming in Monday, and today's Friday, so... got to wait a while, but I'm good with that. Can't wait. So I ordered that, and I ordered some wiring for my fan for my side fan because the side fan I don't want to have the wire coming through like the middle of the mother like the middle of the case I'm gonna have the wire going under the power supply from the back of the power supply under the motherboard maybe and into one of them holes back there so and I'll show you what else I wear the water block the GTZ it's that and here I bought the back plate for the new sockets. I'm gonna have to install this, take off this hold holding bar, and install this. All I have to do is take an Allen wrench and then screw this, these four. And then go back here, pop off that right there, and this should be separated from the water block itself, and then take this one and install onto there and this is the back plate way different than, you, than these as you can see because the new sockets you can tell they have like a big I don't know what it is like it's a heat sink or cools off the back of the CPU keeps the back of the motherboard cold so this is gonna go around that block this is gonna go over it it's gonna be something like that but without that right there Here's an instruction manual, tells you what to do. Take off those screws with the Allen wrench. Pop off that. You need to flip it around, unplug those little things I was showing you. Take that off. You take those out. Install the new one. Pop those back on. Install the Allen wrench, the Allen wrench, the back plate, and pow, you're done. 
And I'm going to show you one more thing here I have is the wiring. I should fix up some of the wiring. This is not how it's going to completely look because I don't know what wire is going to go to where on the motherboard. I know where, but I don't know like where I'm going to have to set it up. But that right there is for the UV light. Then I have my fan controller cables, those through here. Goes to the side of the case. This is where it's kind of more open. I can put like thicker cables in here. Then you have the the 24 pin power cable for your motherboard. I have it coming to the side right now at the moment. That's just that's just taking up a lot of space. But that's just because I don't have the motherboard yet, and that's where it's right now. Then I have let's see what else I have here. Off oh, for the front panel, I have hit this here. I don't know because the front panel controls may be going into these holes up here. I don't really know. We'll see. And then, here's the power for the, well, for the, for the pump, for the, for the water cooling. I don't know where I'm going to set this up. I'm not going to plug it in yet because I'm not going to run the pump dry. And here's the things for the fan. Well, 